At the start of November, Mew and I celebrated our four year anniversary with an Italian dinner. It's December and I'm trying to get into the Christmas spirit um, by going to some Christmas markets. So, sorry if it's noisy and next to the road. Um, I'm going to the Laowaiji Christmas market today. Um, I didn't know about it until last night and I thought, yeah, spontaneous Christmas trip. Christmas without setting up the table for a Christmas dinner.
hello. I've bought some very tacky Christmas balloons. Um, say Merry Christmas on them. So I'm gonna try and put them up. I got these from Taobao and they were the equivalent of like $2. They were really, really cheap. Um, and I expected them to be much smaller than they are. So I don't know whether we can um, actually find somewhere to put them because they're quite big. Um, and they are very bright yellow. Um, I kind of regret not getting the silver, but I'm a gold kind of gal. Um, yeah, <laughs> they are quite yellow though, but still Christmassy. As is Christmas tradition, today I am making a gingerbread house. Um, due to lack of ingredients or English ingredients, I decided just to get the good old IKEA prepackaged one. Um, we ordered this off of Taobao, so I'm not sure if it's broken. But we'll find out. Um, we also have the icing sugar, so I can make icing to put it all back together. Um, and once I've opened it and checked to see what's broken, I'm gonna pop to the shop, get some, maybe some M&Ms, some candy, some chocolate to put on the gingerbread house. So let's see how broken it is. <laughs> oh my goodness, it smells so good. So actually it looks okay. We have those two bits are okay. Oh, a bit of the roof is broken and this side is broken too. So we'll see if we can reconstruct it. Oh dear. So I've managed to puzzle it all back together, all the cracks. I just don't know whether I'll be able to hold it, so I think maybe I'll try and get some candy to reinforce the back. Um, or melt some chocolate or something. I think I'll reinforce the back and fill in the cracks and have some kind of kintsugi <laughs> gingerbread house. Okay, so I've been to the shop to get reinforcements. I have. Pocky, which I thought I could use in the seams where we attach the walls and the roof just to reinforce it a little bit, have something more that it can stick to. So that's reinforcement number one. Number two, I thought I would get these like rainbow candy lace things to act as a glue on the back, um, almost like stitches. So to seal the back, reinforce it and strengthen that, that weak point. So for decoration, I got some M&M type things. They were all out of M&Ms. So I got these, but they don't have very many like nice colors. So I also got some like jelly baby, oh uh, not jelly babies, jelly bean type things because there are some better colors in that. And oh, I have these like milk and strawberry things that my grandma used to have, um, which I thought would be cute. They're quite Christmassy, Christmassy colors. So that's my plan. So step one, reinforce. Step two, decorate. Step three, build. I think that's the best way to do it so that when I decorate, I don't collapse the house. So decorate before building. That's the plan. Fingers crossed. I figure it's okay if I get ice and sugar everywhere because it's like snow, right? <laughs>
<laughs> it's gonna be so messy. It looks like a three-year-old has done it. Oh dear. I've put the jelly babies and the M&Ms on. And it broke. This house, I don't think it can stand. I'll keep trying, but it is a disaster. <laughs> the only good bits are these two. <laughs> and the roof is untouched, but I can't really make a gingerbread roof. this point where the inside's breaking, the outside's breaking. <laughs> Look at the gaps. I think, I think it's a failed mission. Oh dear. I'm totally going to blame the fact that it was broken. I got ice and sugar all over my face. I'm blaming the fact that it was broken when it arrived because each piece is just very structurally, not structural. <laughs> ah! I was just explaining how the only structurally sound bit is this chimney, but. He's not good. Oh, as I'm sat here, it's just falling apart even more. I think it's well and truly dead. It's just... <sighs> dear. Well, there's only one thing to do. Mm. Mm. It might be broken, but it's still delicious. <laughs> Thank you for watching even though things didn't go as planned. Mew and I wish you all a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year.